world is my boss and my word. Back in medieval Scotland, there existed a man. This man was a noble man who wanted only to serve his king. Tempted by power, this man grew dark and was corrupted. This man was... Get out! 
Hey, heaven sisters, I'm sure there's a camp for us to disembowel somewhere around here. I am really special cause there's only one of me Look at my smile, I'm so damn happy other people are jealous of me When I'm sad and lonely, I like to sing this song It cheers me up and shows me that I won't be sad for long Oh, 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 I'm so happy, I can barely breathe Puppy dogs and sugar frogs and kittens, baby teeth Watch out all you mothers, I'm happy, it's hardcore Happy as a coupon for a $20 whore <laughs> I'm really happy, I'm sugar cook Dad, what are you doing? What? Oh, I was eating... I was eating nothing! Anyway, we don't have time for this. Macbeth and Banquo are on their way. They had a very triumphant victory. What did they do again? Hmm? Are you serious? They triumphed over the traitor McDonawald and defended you against Sweeno and the Thane of Cawdor. They even erected a statue for these guys. Everyone loves them! Fantastic! Call Macbeth and Banquo here at once! Man, I told you, they're on their way! And what of the Thane of Cawdor? We killed them this morning! You were there! Malcolm, get dressed. I'll be making an important announcement once our guests arrive. Macbeth! Baby, glad you could make it. Glad to be here. I've been hearing of all the great things you've been doing for me in the battlefield. I really should be rewarding you. Serving you, my king, is a reward on its own. Everybody, gather around. I've got an important announcement to make. In honor of Macbeth's victory, I have made an important decision. When I am gone and will no longer be able to rule as your king, one of you will have to replace me. After much deliberation, I have decided who my successor will be. Meh. 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 Ma 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 Lady, the letter has come for you in the mail. Would you like me to read it for you? Nah, I think I got it. I want you to buy a refrigerator for your turnips. I love refrigerators! Give me that. Macbeth has important news. Uh, he has spoken to some weird sisters who told him of three prophecies. Uh, the first of two have already come true, and the third is that he shall become king. Uh, it goes on to say that the king is on his way for a banquet tonight. The king is coming here tonight? That's a perfect opportunity for us to kill him. Uh, what'd you say? I just don't know if I can go through with this. Where are you, Mark Wahlberg? Okay, okay, I'll, I'll do it. You just take care of his guards. Oh, I've got it all under control. Come, let us prepare for the feast.
calm. I'm a professional. Quickly submerge the arm in mayonnaise. This is Mr. Barbecue! Mr. Barbecue! There you are. Tell me you're ready to murder Duncan. I'm murdering Duncan? I thought we already established this. I'm really having second thoughts about this. Why would I risk all this respect for a shot at the clown? You know what? You're really starting to sound like Mark Wahlberg. <sighs> Fine, I'll kill the king in his sleep all secretly. Ooh. And you better not chicken out last minute. Hey, I'll do my part. You just worry about doing yours. What are you two doing? We are drunk. No, no. He's drunk. Me? I'm drunk. No way, man. I'm way drunk. No, I'm drunker. Why are you two drinking? You're, you're on the job. Job? I thought our job was to fight! Yeah. Shut up, you idiots. Did you let anyone pass this door? No. Definitely. Morons, let me through. Hey, I thought our job was to... Dad, Dad! Dad? Donald Bean? Ketchup Dad? I can't believe this. Donald Bean, wait, I can explain! <laughs> It's not what you think! I have done the deed. I did my part, too. You drank all the booze, then how did you get the guards drunk? They weren't drunk. I told them it was booze. They were drinking grape juice. Children.
What is this? You brought the murder weapon back with you. Murder weapon? It's a cucumber! We must return them before anyone sees them! Cucumber? Isn't that hilarious? I'll take this back to the crime scene. Or we could just eat it. Duff who? Just Macduff. I am here to greet the king. The king? You must be pretty important. I am Macduff, greatest of all things. Then why have I never heard of you? I don't know. Maybe you're just an now idiot. Now you're just hurting my feelings. Listen, I don't have time Oh, for you this. don't have time for this. Well, you had plenty of time to hurt my feelings. I will hurt you if you don't get out of my way. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but your names will never hurt me. I didn't call you a name. You did so. You called me an idiot. That was near eight lines ago. It was only five when I said it. Is this even Macbeth Castle? I don't know. Maybe. Well, is it or isn't it? Keep it down. You'll wake the great Macbeth. Let me in. Did I mention these were the gates to hell? I hate you. Cry, baby. You know what that guy reminded me of? Cottage cheese. Cottage cheese? I don't know what it was, but I couldn't stop thinking about eating cottage cheese. My mom always used to make me stuff I f***ing hate. Yeah, that's great. I'm just gonna go wake the king. You ain't off. Come to think of it, my mother used to make me do a lot of crazy stuff. Like this one time, when I was seven. She caught me trying to shave a coconut with Dad's electric razor. So what she did was, she took me up to the torture rack and... Oh, horror! Tongue nor heart cannot conceive nor name thee. What did you just say? He said that the king is dead. <laughs> The Fresh Maker. It's not dead, it's just ketchup. Excuse me, old man. Have you seen Malcolm run by here? Malcolm? Who cares about Malcolm? The mysterious forces at work. Was that a no? The weather. The temperature. Everything is dark. Well, I'll be. That's not all. The animals have been acting up. The horses! They hate each other! You're a... You're a horse, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah, I am. Sorry, man. Yeah. That's disgusting! There was also an owl that hit a falcon. Whatever, get away from me. I think we have a mystery here, Fleets. How do you figure, Banquo? Well, for starters, this cucumber. Not your average murder weapon, right? But who would use such an absurd weapon? The Riddler? No, Fleance. Think inside the play. What do cucumbers have that daggers don't? Seeds? Exactly. But what kind of seed knows how to become one with God by cloning people? Richard Seed! The physicist! What does he have to do with this? 
I think physics might have everything to do with this place. Victorian! Nope, nothing here. sons fled Scotland, leaving no one in power. Macbeth was crowned despite Macduff's constant whining. I didn't whine. But the more that Macbeth thought about the witches being right, the more he worried about Banquo's safety. Quickly, he hired killers to protect Banquo from his hurtful prophecies. He hired killers to protect someone? Would you shut up? is quickly unraveling, please. I sense danger! Get him, boys! Fly, Flins! Fly! Ah! Macduff runs to England in search of Malcolm. Malcolm, I'm glad I finally found you. Scotland's in a huge mess. You are the one who should be in power. No, I'm not here to trick you. Oh, you wouldn't be that bad of a king. I guess Scotland wouldn't be safe at the hands of a rapist. What's that? You'd be a great king? Come on, then. Enraged by Macduff's treachery. I love nature. I'm just so innocent. Macbeth orders the slaughter of Macduff's family. It feels great to be an invisible king. Turn, Helhound, turn! No, 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 no! You're a fool to challenge me. For I cannot be done in by any man born of woman. You've been fooled. I've got two dads. <gasps> How can this be? Sweet irony. With the execution of Macbeth, Malcolm was crowned and order was restored. Or was it? <laughs> 